Hello everybody. My name is Ling. I'm 10 years old. I'm in class 5B at Thailand No. 2 Primary School. My school is in Tenggongyo State, Boat District, Kwangpin Province. Today, I'm very happy to be here to talk about my hobby. In my daily life, I have several hobbies such as cooking, surfing, listening to music and so on. However, I like reading books the more for some reasons. Firstly, reading makes me feel comfortable after many long, stressful hours at school. I actually like comic books because they contain lots of colorful and interesting images that keep my spirit relaxed. Secondly, reading books provide me a great deal of divine knowledge of many fields. For example, I can know more specific culture of each country in the World Culture Book. In education, I can know more things about different life of different animals live around the world in discovery of animal world book. Finally, reading helps to enhance my vocabulary in both Vietnamese and English language. In Vietnamese book, I can learn many traditional forms or proverbs that help me understand more deeply the beauty of my mother tongue. About the English book, I can improve my English reading computation skill in study. Besides, my computation skill with the Forgisner will be better too. I often spend more time reading books because I think that it's a useful way to learn and play. To enrich my book collection, I often buy many old and new books. I see pocket money which my mother gives me for breakfast or my mother sometimes gives me as a gift for my good result at school. As a weekend, my family usually go shopping. I ask my mother to go to the bookshop to buy me some new book. Whenever I find some good book from my friend, I often borrow to read at one or searching my books. I think sharing books is the way to share knowledge with the others. In conclusion, I really like reading books, for it brings many good things to me. I see it as a useful activity to learn how to make life more meaningful and beautiful. Besides, I love traveling. At weekend, my mom and me often go to the homestay in Phong Nha, and I have trained trees to meet and talk to many folks to improve my English skill. Last weekend, my mother took me to Phong Nha Cave and I'm very excited when I had a train trip to Competition Cave with a foggy snow. Now I want you to watch the video between I and her, please. What's your name? My name is Joanna. Wow, that is a great name. Oh, thank you very much. What is your name? My name is Ling. That is a beautiful name. Does um, it mean something? Um, where do you go to Vietnam? Uh, I came to explore the countryside. No. Okay. And do you like Phong Nha? Oh, yes, yes. Uh, well, I've only come through it. I need to go and look at it properly, but it looks nice, yes. Okay. And, and now do you want to listen to me? I would like to introduce Phong Nha with you. Oh, please, yes, yes. Okay. Designated a useful word heritage site in 2003. Right. The remarkable Phong Nha Kai Bang National Park contains the oldest cut mountain in Asia. Yeah. Formed approximately 400 million years ago. Wow. Wow. <laughs> I didn't know that. Wow. Okay. There are hundreds of cave systems, many of its shoundary, sled, and caves. Uh huh. Okay. Many and steps spectacular a lot of caves. Uh huh. Underground river Phong Nha is Natural heaven on earth. <laughs> yeah. Phong Nha is so beautiful, so yeah. you can fall in love for the first time. Yes, I am. <laughs> there are a lot of homestay, echo stay or fem stay in the world, uh -huh. Uh -huh. which provide vibrant tall rooms a lot of. Right. Come on Phong Nha and enjoy the beauty and people here. Yes, yes. And that is uh, its day uh -huh. to introduce the Phong Nha. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Okay. That's, that's great. Thank you for your time. Oh, no, thank you for your time. It's been very educational. Thank you. Your English is very good. Thank you for your listening.